Hi, this is Yamez with Island Metal Forge, and uh, in this twist series today, uh, we are going through several different types of twists, and uh, this twist specifically, I call a water twist, I've heard it called a river twist, it's fun to call it a reverse river, um, basically, I've heard it called a double twist, and not, you know, like, a, I've heard it called a lot of things. Basically, what you do is you cut, grind, or chisel a line along each of the four sides, okay? You could do this with a swedge if you'd like. You can, you know, do a rope, you know, put a rope into it and twist it like that. It's similar. Uh, but all I did was grind a line down each side, and I'm going to do it reverse because, again, you know what a uh, regular twist looks like. This is a different technique with the reverse twist. As in the previous video, over here, back here, I don't know where you put it. Wherever you put it, it's in this tab that's up here. Yeah, uh, next to the uh, other stuff. But uh, I only did one, t one reversal. In this one, I'm going to do multiples, probably three or four, to show you uh, loose, tight, reversed, you know, tighter, looser, different techniques, a different, a tighter uh, reversal, a looser reversal, the different types of, uh, and, you know, the different types of alternating twists, and how to achieve that. Enjoy. Okay, now this is the reverse river twist. We'll turn there. Okay. Clean that off, show you what I got so far. With the grooves in it, you know, it's like a water twist or a river twist, it's just a double twist. There's a lot of different names. Um, but, you know, it's really neat. You know, it looks, it gives it a bit of dimension, it gives the, the regular normal twist a bit of a dimension, you know, that you don't get otherwise. I cool the end off of that. And I'm not going to cool as much as I did last time, because I want a tighter twist. Because I'm going to do a double reverse on this. Okay, heated it up. And I'm cooling, not all the way, just a bit, right? And then I went counterclockwise the first time. Now I'm going to go clockwise again. But I'm doing it tighter here. And I'm only going to do for this one a little bit. All right. stuck. There we go. All right. Now you see, there's a real nice reversal on that. So now I'm going to do that again here. I'm going to cool that end off. Again, not all the way, so I want it tight. I don't want a huge gap between the reverses. All right. I got a little bit of over hot, but for this purpose, I don't think it makes a difference. A little bit of a burn.
right? Now I did counterclockwise, then clockwise. Now this time I'm gonna go counterclockwise again. soft one just to get it done and show you All right. clean that up alright like I said a little bit of burns on it but you just watch your heat you know a little bit of burns right here you just watch your heat and then it goes boom boom and then boom again you know double reverse twist again you can do this multiple times in you know multiple patterns you can do tight wide tight wide you know different techniques using this exact base okay so that's what I call a water twist a reverse river twist okay so cool that off and set that down Yeah. You know, so again, if you jump straight to this video instead of watching the previous videos, um, this is uh, what I do. I do what I have with what I have. You know, I do what I got with what I got. Uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Uh, follow me on Facebook. I do live weekends. Uh, Saturdays around noon, I go live. Uh, I've been doing this about seven months and you know, less than a year, seven, eight months at this point. Not sure what month it is. But anyway, uh, go on, move to the next one. It's, uh, it's going to be a fun one. And uh, I will see you there. All right, thank you. For John.